Former semi-pro football players from all over the country came to Newcomer Funeral Home in North Syracuse to pay their respects to a man who many say changed the game. You give just a little bit more when you're playing next to the guy that's someone that's part of what you consider a family and you play a little bit harder when you have an owner that you believe really, really cares for you. Semi-professional football has been on the scene in our state since the 60s. But in 1984, Greg Portsline became the owner of the Syracuse Express. And former players say he elevated the sport. He had a big heart and he was very professional. He did everything the right way. He took good care of his players like his, took care of his family. We were part of his family. Portsline's players saw him as a father figure. He treated them with respect, ran the Syracuse Express like a professional operation. His model led to three national championships and became the blueprint for owners across the league. As for me, I know that I would never have had the football career that I had. And I know that I'd never be the man that I am. Portsline died unexpectedly Monday of a stomach aneurysm. He survived by his wife and 10 children. He was 71. In North Syracuse, Kelly Cowan reporting.